by five. I made them a little longer than the last time we showed them off since they were a little going by a little quicker. So let me know if you feel like the length of them is a little better in this one. So this was from one of our recent sessions. I liked it, the angle of this one particularly with the pose of that. So it's why I chose it. So anyone have anything to say about it? You have a pencil. I forgot pencil. They're all, they're all pencils. <laughs> Back there, if for some reason you need white. <clears throat> but yeah. It's a little more centered instead of using a little bit more off to the side, but you know, that's not always the end of the world, obviously. I just kind of liked the backdrop and everything. I thought it was just really nice. Which world was which, that which in? World, which world was it? That yeah. was that magical one that had the big clock hand and uh, paintings and potions and things. Uh, that was after I'm... we saw William in that weird half-light world thing. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm trying to place whereabouts that was in the world. Uh, I believe oh. that was beside the hallway that took you to the second floor, if I remember correctly. If I went in. Oh. It's something about the yeah, lightning. <laughs> oh, like, uh, the, the wed? That is coming from the blade. And not the, uh, like, I can... when I see it, like, I want to see details about, like, hairs. Like, for me, it's just oh. pitch black. Like, I the barely, I cannot see details. Yeah. That lightning, yeah. that light, lighting. I miss all Yeah. It. My bad. Uh, that's a fair criticism. The hair is pretty much, uh, um, what's the word I'm looking for? Bleeding into the darkness of the background. That's a fair criticism. <laughs> you get a point. <laughs> that is a legit complaint. It's wound. <laughs> okay. It is destroyed and forever gone. Wait, is my hip track more? <clears throat> yeah, I think my hip track. I'm confused. What class is this? <laughs> it's a photo clock. The photo clock. I like it. I. Second one, why? I think um. You got something to say on that one? Go ahead. I think, uh, like a better or just a different angle would, uh, make it a little more powerful shot. Yeah, perhaps I had gone a little bit more angled so some more wed helped define the, the hair a little bit more as an outlining. That would definitely fix that. Like I would try, I would uh, go a little lower and like to the right, and then shoot, shoot like mm. upwards, and then have your sword angled down, kind of toward the camera a little bit, so it would lead your mm. eye toward the rest of the photo. Yeah, I, think, I think that would uh, make it a lot, a lot more like a superhero that. shot or whatever. <laughs> Yeah, I did go, like, I was trying, uh, originally some, uh, like, peeking, because there was space behind this photo. So I was trying a few, like, pictures, like, peeking around in that. And then I, oh, I yeah. tried to pose like this. So, and I, I just kind of liked it, that, so that's why I chose it like said. Okay. For the second one, if no one else, anyone else? Nope, nope, going once. Going twice. So. Go and give me one second to go ahead and examine. I'm going to figure out why my hip track was not turning on. Yeah. I think maybe my receiver might be off. That world was um, beautiful. Was that that, uh, that desert world? 
Yeah, yeah. This, yeah, it was the thing in the, uh, the thing underneath with the the, tr the giant tree. Yeah. And the massive white void outside that window. And you took a picture of the statue's butt. Yep. <laughs> I still had my USB drive from <laughs> uploading the, the video, so I sacrificed my hip for it. My hip was sacrificed for this video. I hope you appreciate it. Anyway, um, yeah, both Jess and Wob were doing this session. Uh, yeah, this is that underground area that had that big white void uh, that you can see some white tail. Actually, where's the laser pin? Uh... I forgot where the laser pin was at. Ah, here we are. Yeah, we do have pointy little lazy pins that we can use. So, yeah, there's remnants of that white space that you all were doing random weird things at. But yeah, I like the, the tree of that. I, I wish I could have gotten a, a little bit, like, a little, but because of how the collision was that, it was kind of funky. So that was about the best I got out, trying photos for that. I mean, I think I have like the same criticism. It's a nice photo opportunity. I just think a, a better angle would Different help angle. it a little more. I, I have a particular weakness at getting really good angles in VR. It's hard to get like, I, good angles with the drone, you know, because you can only hold the, <laughs> fly the drone at a level angle. Right. Like you can't tilt, you know, it's, can't like, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. like there was a photo you can't roll it, basically. To, there was a photo I wanted to take upside down, but yeah, anytime I triggered the drone mode, it would flip it back around. I'm like, no, I want you backwards. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, you have to set up the camera angle beforehand, and then go yeah. go pose in it. Which I guess is the advantage yeah. of having play space removal uh, assist in that regards. But yeah, to be fair, I wasn't a really big fan of having all this here, but... Yeah, that's what I was going to talk about, like, what is this? Like... Uh, it's a tree that's inside a pit, so it's in this big light pit oh. here, so... I would have liked it more to been leveled, but obviously I can't change the world in that regard. But yeah, it's in, just in this giant pit of light of that underground. It was in a desert. Like, uh, one of Wob's photos is from the desert area, so you can see what the surface world of this world looked like. But, uh, yeah, I would have weathered if it was a, a leveled thing, but, you know, that's, that's dealing with the world. And, uh, yeah, it, it probably would have been if I could find that white angle. And I did try a few different ones. But some of the other ones I got, well, this was, like, blocking some of the visuals. So I just decided to do a side view where I was initially trying to do some angle shots looking at me. And another one problem angle. with some of the branches. Yep. Mm -hmm. One angle you can get is if you do it from above. Mm. Yeah, I could maybe because the branches ain't too much of trouble there. But yeah, there there are some oh, branches that will. If you put the camera in the branches, so you can see some of the leaves looking at you oh, from yeah. up down. Hmm? If you can get a good angle where they look like uh, they're not mm -hmm. necessarily blocking the main focus and just kind of adding maybe like a unfocused foreground effect that that could be a very nice <laughs> but I think we will gain way to leave the world I think when I did this I can't remember <laughs> that was a that was a very <laughs> disordered desolate world other than this underground area anyone else got anything nope okay okay so the chat man for two hundred dollars gotcha Now this was a, a water world me and me, Jess and Wob, 
and Marcus will end this session. And uh, it's pretty oh, nice like uh, little world of that. It has actual floating physics for you and uh, several objects in the wall, and you can actually ride in the intro tubes and that. Um, I've been to this world three times on other occasions other than uh, the photo meet that I actually did a rant about uh, Blizzard for my channel actually in this world just chilling on the tube just ranting about uh, Blizzard being stupid but you know that's a, that's a <laughs> different subject though. That's but, a uh, good, yeah. reason, good reason to rant. <laughs> <laughs> well you gotta be chill when dealing with, stu with stupid company stuff right? <laughs> <laughs> but uh, it's a pretty nice world there, and uh, I I kind of went in with the mindset that I wanted to find a nice angle to do kind of like, aha, or look at where I am, or like I, like this is my vacation or something kind of kind of vibe to it. And I I I really liked how this one turned out. Probably the only yeah. thing I wish is if I could have gotten my whole head in, but uh, you know that's being probably getting to a little minor nitpicks. Uh, I kind of like having the hand unfocused because it kind of <laughs> gives you, it kind of gives you depth of <laughs> me in the photo going from really close to me pointing at what's in the, the background. Mm-hmm. I like yeah. it. You, uh... Um... I... I'm sorry. Go ahead. No, no. You start. You start. You start. It's okay. <laughs> I think you kind of you look like a travel blogger. Yeah. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> like Chibi Snuffy the TikToker, <laughs> the child friendly Snuffy avatar. Like you're <laughs> promoting, you know, your hotel's water park or something. <laughs> Ooh! Oh no! It's com It's even worse. It's companies trying to be <laughs> TikTokers. It's even worse than oh, what you imagine. <laughs> yeah, it's like when they try and get with the trends. Oh, man. Hey, my fellow kids, how you doing? You're all skateboarding tonight. We bust now to yeah. take Genesis and Sonic. <laughs> I just... Now, yeah, I, like, now I just need, like, an insult that meme of uh, that sitcom with that uh, Don Knotts wearing, like, all the 90s shit with the skateboard. It's like that scene in Ready Player Me. Hmm. Trying to... That was the one where there was like a secret in like a old Atari game or something, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, he's, he was trying to... Uh, yeah. um, make it look like he was in with the... The new crowd or whatever. The so Company guy. And he's like... Yeah, I'll knock back an Orange Crush and listen to Duran Duran and... And all this other <laughs> crap he was saying. I remember watching it, but I don't remember everything about it. It was a, definitely an interesting movie. I remember that. Anyone else got anything to say? No negatives? No super negatives? Mm -hmm. No, I like One it. of my favorite picks, <laughs> I, I guess, so far of this, yeah. Ah. Nice. Yeah. I'm liking how there's a lot of positivity on this one. Yay! Maybe I should have edited Marcus, like, in his picture where he was upside down <laughs> in there. Yeah, I feel like it's missing Yeah, stuff. just have... It I needs, feel like it's it, it needs That's to have somebody thing. drowning in the background. Yeah, let's... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I feel like it's a little bit fancy. <laughs> While you're busy you on your TikTok phone and your kid's drowning in the back. <laughs> I believe um, you did. I think you did. I, I don't remember. It was, it was, it was like three weeks ago I saw bit in my photos. I don't even know anymore what my photos were. I can't remember. I remember I saw somebody's photo of Marcus is upside down in a, I believe it was a green intro tube. And I was just thinking, you know, I should have like seen about like cropping that out and just putting it right there. Is it like just having this <laughs> hilarious little somebody drowning there kind of thing where it just added a little <clears throat> just mwah, to the back one. <laughs> yeah. Okay. And we'll go on the next one. So this 
this was from the last session. This was uh, me, Jess, and Titanium joined for just a wee little bit. And uh, this is Titanium uh, doing these shenanigans. So this was a very interesting world that Jess took us to. Uh, gave me very uh, Neo Automata vibes of the final area, if you're familiar with that game. Uh, that's the kind of vibes it gave me. It was pretty interesting. But uh, Titanium has this like really weird mouse pizza mouse avatar and it can like do this weird just these are just hundreds of rats running around with pieces of pizza i got yeah, a I mean, few uh, different only... photos of this i was gonna ask if they were rats but i had no idea what they were wearing on their heads i was like is that a party hat like what is what is this no, what's going on there slices of pizza pizza <laughs> running away stealing from oh. five nights of freddy's <laughs> i thought they were like among us rats <laughs> oh, yeah, no. like right here, this is like the visor <laughs> thingy, and like, okay, this is a Oh, us. I see that. <laughs> I, 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 I could maybe see that at a distance, but I would probably say try a tablet look a little close. Is it the ears of the, the mice then? Yeah, the, the right. green, the green oh, yeah. is the ear, and it has like a uh, bit of a wet middle. mask over its eyes. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's like a oh, like ninja, ninja mice, ninja rats. See, that's Gosh. what that's what's nice about the tablets. I like having the tablets try see little things like that when I'm in the cloud. Yeah, like, that's yeah, a they're good just one. rats stealing pizza. But I just <laughs> found a bunch of different <laughs> angles. Like, and I just kind of liked it how this one was. Where did they get the pizza but from? That's what I want to know. Yeah, that's a know. lot of pizza. I it's didn't like, see any pizza when we was in the world. somewhere on that world. You know, maybe it's like the future when, you know, it's the remnants of security breach or something, you know. Maybe that's the whole secret of the world. Ooh. <laughs> but this one I just thought was uh, something silly to throw in for the most part. Uh, I, I, out of the ones I did, I did like this one. I just thought I'd uh, bring a little humor into the choices that. Yeah, you can yeah. title this picture 30 minutes or less. Toy man, so less. <laughs> Does anyone have anything to say? Nobody want to criticize the giant like thing of blood going into the waddle. You know, might be uh, controlling <laughs> for health reasons. You know, bloody pizzas. Maybe ah, that adds more story <laughs> to the picture then. Yeah. <laughs> It's, a, it's the rats are collecting food to to yeah, give that's... to some sort of overlord in that blood waterfall. That's tomato sauce. Huh? What are you talking about? Tomato sauce. <laughs> They're it's making a, a giant pizza. Tomato sauce factory. <laughs> now, now we, we know the wall of where all the pizza comes from in the world. Fantastic. So it's like a it's a sequel to Ratatouille. You know, these rats travel in this <laughs> underground place. It went into the giant tomato sauce thing and then, you know, deliver it to your house and that. They're like South Park Underworld gnomes, except, you know, with pizza and profit. Something yeah, that's man. actually going to be profit. <laughs> we are profit. Stocks are going up. <laughs> so I think no it's, a, it's a good example of like a chaotic shot and like a lot going on. It tells us. Mm -hmm. Indeed. Wondering what's yeah, happening. They, really. they continuously, they continuously come from a spawn point and just continuously run in the direction <laughs> they're running. So yeah, <laughs> uh, I think I did about 15 photos of this, I believe, in different angles that oh, they had them running around. So, uh, like I said, this one I particularly think had a nice balance of uh, different directions and that. There was some like running along the actual path that I thought was maybe a little bit more. Mm, Bit more plain. But, eh. Well, no one else has anything. Going once, win twice. Sold again to Chapman because he's not here. You gotta whack up that bill while he's not here, you know. And then should be my last one. This session no, was with me, Wob, and a few of my friends that are friends of Synthage. Uh, joined in heal. Uh, this is Uwu. Not to be confused with the other person who has an even longer version of Uwu in the VR dance group. Um, May they rest but, uh, in peace. This world, 
<laughs> but this uh, this world was kind of like a little mall kind of place. It had a lot of different like stores and stuff, and it had like this knockoff uh, GameStop. I think it was called uh, BitStop or Bit Games or something. I can't quite remember. I have a picture that has the logo in it. But uh, Wob bought up this knife. I, at least I think he was the either him or Uwu bought it up to the store, and several people took different photos doing things with the knife but uh, i decided to take my own stab at it <laughs> uh yeah that's a horrible pun i apologize but uh yeah i, I, I thought it was just uh, <laughs> i thought it was just another uh silly one to throw in with it too with it but i liked how it turned out to a nice uh blow mm-hmm. effect the show like being a little away from the target just Innocently looking at these retro games that probably cost a hundred plus dollars, which just makes me cry for anyone who wants to play any of these. <laughs> you poor people who didn't grow up on this stuff. Yeah, dang, dang younglings! <laughs> anyone got anything to say? Bad, good. Uh, I just kind of. Wish like the no like the knife was oh. more in focus. Hmm. Focus is uh, another thing I'm not super great because uh, like I always have trouble getting what I want. But yeah, I could see like having the arm be blurred and try to have maybe it start focusing more. It does look like it maybe focuses a little. Yeah, on the on the tip there's a tell. bit of focus, but. But yeah, I could see maybe it would have been nicer to have it more half or seventy-five percent of the knife have it focusing. That probably mm-hmm. would have been a nice touch. But yeah, it's for me. It's always weird trying to like target how the camera is going to focus things at times. Yeah. I remember. Yeah. I remember one session where Chapman specifically asked me about why I had the focus on, I think it was a walk. I think it was a photo where I had a avatar that was kind of like a Japanese spirit with a like stick and a lantern on that. And the focus was like set on a walk. And I was like, ah, and I was really old, like, I didn't take a lot of VR photos, so I wasn't really used to a lot of the additional features of, like, messing with focus and that. So, and it's still something, it's, I understand the bell now, obviously, but then it was definitely something I, I didn't really know how to properly aim at all. So I was kind of like, I don't know, good question. <laughs> I wish I knew why it was at a walk. <laughs> I was just messing with the 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 different finger the bobs. <laughs> That's how you're going after. Uh. Anything else anyone want to add? I assume this was um this was a pretty much a candid shot, right? For at least the person you're stabbing. Yeah. Uh, Uwu did not have any idea. I don't even think Uwu ever even knows <laughs> I did that. I don't think. I'd have to go back and check the the video, but I'm I'm pretty sure he just looked at those. I did that, and then uh, just went on to do whatever else I did after that. <laughs> but yeah, uh, this was not a posed moment. It was just a act of the moment, you could say, Your Honor. <laughs> it was just I just felt just a spur. Like I didn't mean to kill him. Yeah. It the just best happened. Option. I was just so mad that like. Ocarina times like $120, Majora's Mask 200 and don't get me on Banjo-Kazooie, man. And like, do you know how much Mario Galaxy is now because the horrible Switch version, man? It's so terrible. Oh, it really makes know, you wonder on, what he process. does behind our backs when we're not looking, you know? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> Who knows? <laughs> I do have a lot of video games. I might have to video games might come get an avatar with eyes in the back of its head now. Yeah. Hello. Just, just also, like the arm. video is playing, it's because you entered here. Uh, if I do this, it should sync it to you, I think. So it should be paused Well, we have it now. Uh, we are doing yes. the photo club right now. You're welcome to join if you want. 
Uh, this is our critique night, so we're showing off choices that we picked for photos and just critiquing them. Positive, negative, things we may have done differently opposed to the person who took the photo. So you're welcome to join, or if you want to watch that, it's all cool. Uh, we all live streaming this though, just to let you know, so. Mm-hmm. Yeah, but, uh, the cam just, was, just watch but the cam from was... the back. <laughs> okay, you're fine. Camera's uh, focused here, so you don't have to worry about uh, if you're uh, camera shy of that. Anywho, anywho. Um, okay. Well, uh, would you like to add on this? I was just about to move on from uh, this photo, and I think it was going to be just torn. But if you want to add some more quick to this photo, you're welcome to. You should be seeing a photo of a knife if it's properly synced to the nail. Mm hmm. <laughs> I can also show you the other ones really quick if nobody minds. If you want to see them real quick, I'll just let play. That way, oh, in case anyone uh, references anything, that way you can uh, stay in the loop a little. Uh huh. But yeah, each person chose five, so. Uh, yeah, those are my five. If you want to comment on any of them real quick, before we move on, Jess, if you want. Well, I really like the one where uh, you were sitting uh, on the side of the picture. I feel like that, that could even be mm. like See, a cool liked it. wallpaper. <laughs> <laughs> liked it. That's so nice. We didn't say we didn't like it, you know. <laughs> like, <laughs> I just said you, maybe a different fine, angle. Just... <laughs> <laughs> you're fine. You're fine. I mean, I do admit, like, I I never having trouble because I I did not like all this, but like sewing angles, I had branches and things and stuff, and I just I didn't I couldn't find the right angle other than a side view, which, like I said, I couldn't get to look very flat completely. Because, like, if I remember correctly, play space was, like, having a weird reaction to the tree. So, and just like, ah. But, okay. Well, then, uh, we'll go ahead and... Like I said, it should <clears throat> be just up next. Yep. Okay, right. so we'll go ahead and play, and, uh, we'll go through them one by one. So. <laughs> Oh, the world I couldn't join. Sag. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that world was really heavy. Yeah, I'm assuming that's the Devil May Cry world we went to, I'm assuming. Yeah. That's the Matrix world we went to. And that should... I think that was the last one, No. That one should be the last one. Okay. Yeah. Come on, Slayer. Okay, then. Okay, well, if you want to step on up, if you want to, you don't have to. It's not the first wordy, uh, wo uh, wordy o for you. But if you want to raise a pole in law, go ahead. Yeah, Rob unfortunately couldn't join this world. Did it just crash you or, or yeah, something? Or? I see him by yeah, the way. it crashed me like several times mm -hmm. over. It was either too big or just too optimized. Yeah. <laughs> it was it was a very laggy world. I think there's a it new was, newer version uh, of it though that just came out that should be better. Oh. I, I should have meant yeah, like it, it, it had laggy, a but. it had a wheel like. Some of the places I moved in, it would just smear my vision, just moving a little in most of the places. It was, it had nice environment, it just hard to see it without being completely still. <laughs> it was a shame. Um, I like the angle. I like seeing a lot of the plants mm -hmm. and going in more than that. And being a big hallway, I, it definitely, uh, benefits from an up-down slight angle instead of landscaping and that. 
I think oh, yeah. uh, probably I would probably give a similar criticism some of you gave with my pool one at uh, probably uh, having some people in the background or something would probably just added a little something there because it doesn't uh, <laughs> let me get a tablet here so I can see closer I don't think I there see there was no people there it was just me and you yeah, <laughs> yeah I couldn't I couldn't <laughs> tell because there's a, there's a little discoloration <laughs> right, right, right there so I couldn't tell if that's somebody hiding in the in the plants, but no, I think that I think that's some of the lighting now. I think I, I will say this much: with the sort of look that that world has, I don't think many people are praying anymore. But <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, I, I bumped up the uh, yeah. colors and made it a lot more vibrant than it was. It was kind of a oh. like it was kind of a lot a lot more dull than this. Hmm. Didn't even notice. I'd have to take a look at my photos. I did a few photos, like in this, like I had my camera in this side hallway and did a few going sideways with me sitting between the those little pieces of wood there. Um, they weren't too bad, but I, I decided to go with uh, the ones I did. Maybe I'll throw it in the, the critique tab on Discord if you want to see some of those though. Anyone else got anything? say with uh, this particular photo mm -hmm. Not me. no no nothing omega no lack of cats mm. or milk <laughs> there's not a single cat in this damn photo <laughs> there is some cats there is cats you can see them right there <laughs> the <cat>. spider cats <laughs> Spider cat, spider cat, hissing and pulling back. <laughs> okay, we'll go ahead to the next one then. Okay. Hmm. I think I same thing as last time. A little bit too empty. Hmm. Yeah, I could do with somebody like boning in their phone and going, oh god. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know what would have been funny if somebody had like a Terminator like avatar and they're just like falling out like barely oh. like from the corner there. That would that would be an interesting uh, posed photo though. <laughs> it's like our doom oh, guy right here. Back. Doom guy. <laughs> da -da -da -da. <laughs> Uh, uh, it's always fun hearing ideas people think about with these. <laughs> I don't remember the particular. This this is that Devil May Cry world though, wasn't it? Yeah. I'm pretty sure that was. Yeah, this this spot the was off the beaten. Spot it was off the beaten path. You had to like go behind mm, a go behind a rock. And uh, oh. then there is a little hallway, and then there is this. Keeping secrets <laughs> from everyone I see. Dwayne? <laughs> but yeah, I, I probably would have to say the same thing. Probably having somebody doing something, whether it be boring, coming out, looking all badass or something. Probably be nice. And Pi would be able to do it pretty easy, even like put something transparent in there. Well, and there was. go in with the, like the eraser tool, will. I'd have to go there with somebody to do that because there's an invisible wall right here. <laughs> so I could, that's as close as oh. I could get. Yeah. Wow. And uh, we'd have too. to, we'd have well, to like to it glitch in, through then. the wall and, and all that other crap. Oh, well, then. You can't get I an do. avatar with C. Let them sit. Yeah, and that's what I mean. And you should go glitch through, that glitch through it mm -hmm. with the seat, yeah. Yeah, that can work too. <clears throat> have a chicken. But other than that, have a chicken with a seat. <laughs> other than that, it is a pretty, uh, everyone knows silly, silly seats. I just have a fishing pole. <laughs> I do like uh, uh, the lighting in it. It has very nice going from really bright and having a warm tone around the environment and, you know, having absolute mm -hmm. darkness. Looks like you could use it as like a. <laughs> yeah, I thought it kind of looked like uh, like the gates to hell or something. 
I was gonna say it would mm -hmm. be like really good for like a like a backdrop for like uh, maybe like a D and D or some medieval thing. The logo, maybe add a few characters, like facing getting way to go into the fury of hell or something. <laughs> Diablo one, we mastered. Then have like the, the royal or the. <laughs> Or just add the small kitten right there, looking at small you. kitten. <laughs> yeah, just like <laughs> banging, just banging a cup on the bars. Perfection. <laughs> just absolute perfection akin. Yes, absolute perfection. I mean, what what more could somebody want than having additional kin? Like, hey, anyone else got anything else to add? If not, I'll swap it to the next one. Go once, go twice. Okay. So this one I'm personally oh, curious, did you do any editing with this one? Because I can't remember getting any kind of oh, yeah. multi-imagery in that world. Yeah, I edited it. Um, I mean, I edited, I edited pretty much all my pictures when I put them on Twitter and stuff. I just thought that fit the. No, I thought this like kaleidoscope uh, setting or whatever. I thought it kind of did did yeah. good with the world because it's the Matrix, you know, and there's like code everywhere, mm -hmm. and you know the multiple realities and crap or whatever. And I just thought it I like it mean. before. I did that with the imagery, you know the kaleidoscope setting mm -hmm. it was kind of like a boring i thought it was kind of boring picture you know but uh after i did that i thought it was a lot it was a lot better but i don't know what y'all what y'all think about it i definitely i like the idea and the effect but the only thing and like i'd hate to make this comparison so i'm playing a new <laughs> title that's like a really weird reimagining of Another title I played before it called Middle Max Xena Reborn that changes from a torn based JRPG to a weird active torn based RPG. It's weird, but it has this weird problem in the desert where you could see the textures connect and you see these lines where they connect and they're not like, you know, the like seams. smooth it. Yeah. And it's really nose for it, and, I, and I, I'd hate to make the comparison, but, like, you get that, you can see the, like, seams with the, and they just, they stand out really much for me. Some of them ain't, like, like the one here, you could argue, kind of, could be, like, sways of this light, but, like, I'd say that one, there, were the ones that, like, bothered me the most out of them. I think that's, I think that's, is it, that, is it done on purpose though? Like, it's yeah. <laughs> it is. I mean, I imagine what they are is, I'm assuming you took the same photo and did different transparency, I'm assuming. No, I mean it's it's literally I'm like I just it? I just hit a button and uh, it does this automatically, and then oh, I so I can you, I can oh, like to, uh, there's a sliding so. bar and I can just um, no, I can make it less or more, so like if I if I put it all the you know mm -hmm. all the way to max there would probably be like twenty different characters. Yeah, so you were messing with the transparency. So yeah, the the. Depending on the transparencies you were doing, then uh, left some of the seams a little bit more noticeable from different ones. Yee yee. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing when you, um, if you don't like do green screen or like use the uh, the the manual uh, tool to cut around things. Uh, that's usually something you have to be careful when you transparent something without cutting it out is sometimes having the borders of the image be noticeable in it. Sometimes, uh, depending, like, because um, there's also, like, different, uh, like, different brightness, like, 
this the top and bottom have a different brightness to them on this so if they were the similar brightness you could go in with like a little smudgy tool and kind of get rid of that line but since they're two different light and darkness that would be a lot trickier not impossible but trickier but i i do like the idea of it though don't get me wrong on that at all very nice idea just saying that, like, I like the ones on the top better. I feel like they go really well with the, the white lines that are happening there. But see, like, you don't have a white line there. And then you got these two that just cut off because it's the edge of those. So I, I definitely like the top half better than the, the, the little bo bits there on the bottom. But that's just my two cents in the criticism. Overall, though, I like the idea of trying to do like a multiple thing matrix matrixy kind of glitch kind of thing it was a nice idea like it anyone else got anything else uh, well i think these uh sharp lines actually add more to the aesthetic like at the bottom you see the two different uh, brightnesses as well it makes it look like uh, it's a bunch of glass shards and this is the reflection that we are getting from a, a shattering uh, piece of glass that's actually very interesting because he had a photo like that in the last session that was like a broken mirror so that's actually a very interesting interesting to hear there that, that would if it had like a more jaggedy look uh that aesthetic would actually go really nice with it. But since it's a straight line, it just seems kind of odd to me. But that, I can understand yeah, that. it's a bit unnatural. Visual. Yeah, if it was just a little bit jaggy like in a broken sense, that, that actually would be a very nice aesthetic with it. it, it in some ways, it's difficult to know where the lines begin and end. They don't go fully, like, it doesn't go straight up through the top of the image. They sort of just yeah, sort of come they're, in parts they're and at an angle and yeah, which I like. Go once, go on twice. Another one to add, Chapman's bill. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> who's gonna Who's gonna tell him after this session how much he owes? By the way. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, is this a swimming? Is this the swimming pool or was it underwater? Yeah. No, it wasn't That's under. What I thought it was. It's not underwater. I was. I was. Uh. Water behind water? the waterfall. Oh. Mm. Okay. Yeah. I thought, at first, getting... I thought I was looking at a beach. Sorry. <laughs> the... <laughs> well, like, well, that's definitely rocks there. Yeah. Here's the yeah. the rocks, and then there's a tree. There's tree, and then there's a there's the main tree. Cause the and then th these are the ceiling. A lot of walks. Yeah, these are the ceiling lights, mm -hmm. right here. Yeah, and I think that's what gives the impression that's under the water versus being like behind the waterfall, is because you're seeing those prominently. Mm -hmm. It's a nice aesthetic effect, and plus, you know. You know, you could you could actually like this area around this tree over here. I'm kind of thinking you could have whipped some of that out and added it into your matrix thing, lower the transparency some, and you could use those as like <laughs> cracks for a mirror. I don't know how to use I'm Photoshop. Like, you know <laughs> okay. <laughs> you like you talk about all these complicated <laughs> like mixing merging pictures together and everything. See, these, these are all the cracks you would need to hide up some of those lines and make them look like that kind of imagery. <laughs> like this, this area here would be perfect. You could even probably use the, uh, the, um, the, the, um, the, um, what's the term I'm looking for? It's the, it's where you get with green screen. Uh, the, um, the, um, ah, I'm not good with technical words because I'm dumb. You could use the tool you use with green screen and just had the the ocean color and probably get a good bit of that out. Um, that's more of a manual system. Um, oh man, and I was just using the it today. Keying out the, the green. Keying, yes. Keying out the color. Uh, yes, yes. That's terminology. Uh, 
Thank you. <laughs> See, somebody a small on me. <laughs> but yeah, that 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 corner section would have been perfect to actually snip it and try that idea with. <laughs> But yeah, I, I, I deal with a lot of that stuff, so I understand that's a, a, you know, something I know thing more than understandable of that. But I like it. I like it. I think maybe having Marcus drowning upside down in it edited <laughs> in showing him, you know, facing the camera would have uh, added more to the illusion that this is underwater, too. <laughs> uh, but I don't think anyone got it. I don't think anyone got any pictures of him from that angle, though, so... <laughs> but, uh, I like it, that. Uh, it has a, like, the, the water effect and everything gives a very interesting kind of strange effect to the whole thing. It makes you question whether it's underwater or some other yeah. bizarro filter or something. Because, I mean, it, it does look like a lot of cracks and not necessarily, like, this bottom corner looks like water, so it kind of... Is an odd effect. Yeah, that was that was all the waterfall, the water falling, and I just shot through it. And that's probably why it's not as blue as down there. It's the main body, which probably makes people a little confused, like because, like I said, you your first star is like this is underwater, but then you know you notice that, and then it's like wait a minute, then yeah. what's this? <laughs> <laughs> why is it blue? -wool? Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't really have anything really negative to say that. Mm. I do think, like, the lights how, because they start out big and then get smaller, kind of help draw your eyes through the middle area, too. Anyone else? Once, doing twice. All right. Oh. So I was just making a noise. Then was it one more? Yeah, there was that one. So this was in that world with uh, that I did the whack thing, and this was near the end of the world where I had this big white area. With a really strange circular thing, which you can't see in this photo, but uh, that's where this one was. Is that uh, that's is that me? You yeah, that's in me. your dark that's soul. Me, <laughs> yeah. Yes, 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 yes. Uh, yes. Okay. Now that, those were poses. Good, he, don't don't want don't want him make you think those are candid. Those were poses. <laughs> he says they're <laughs> okay. candid. The lies. Yeah. The lies. No, I mean it was. It wasn't candid. Yeah, he just got done throwing like the smoke bomb thing or whatever. All this stuff is. Yeah, hex magic. It has two hex spells that I can throw. What the heck? Yeah, he told me to pose, so I did some posing, and then I did a few attacks and throwing fireball stuff and that. I really like this 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 photo. A lot. Same. Even though even though it's staged, it almost feels like it's candid anyway. Well, you could mm. say it's kind of hybrid candid because, like I said, I love this uh, after. Oh, go ahead. The reflection right here that you can see it. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, yeah. It's pretty dark, but yeah, you can indeed see a reflection there if you take a good look at it. You can mm -hmm. see. Yeah, you can see the cat if you look real close. Yeah, that's why I like <laughs> that's why I like having the tablets when you want to examine little details like that more easier. That's why I like the tablets myself. <laughs> but uh, you know, I I kind of feel like you could use this as a thumbnail for like uh like a YouTube OST uh video playing one of the Souls uh, songs or that just have it be a <laughs> photo. You know, it's like have one of the songs. No, 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 no. You know. <laughs> yeah, I know. I butchered the song. Don't judge me. <laughs> but yeah, I like I the. A bit ominous. 
<laughs> yeah, it gives the the lighting in the background gives a very ominous oh. vibe because there's a, there's a lot of settings in the Soul series that can have uh, this kind of vibe to it. So I I like the the bright nothingness in the background. To be honest, I feel like it adds an ominous look with the smoke of that. Now, without the context of knowing what that smoke is, you know, you can think it's multiple things. Actually, when you look at it, it looks like maybe it's like being breathed from the head. It's like... (laughs) So much under the helmet, man. It's not easy doing this job, you know. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah, I like it. A nice detail with the reflection. A little hard to see, but yeah, once you notice it, it's a nice little extra touch still. Could he maybe had some shenanigans editing now? <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, I don't really have anything to say. I like the angle on that. Anyone else? Going once. Going twice. Another one for Chapman Phil. Oh, yep. <laughs> uh, I did show. Oh. oh, Rob's up. Thank you for joining. <laughs> You're always welcome to join if you want. All right, dude. Take it easy. Goodbye. Okay. See you guys. Rob's all ready. Take it easy. I'm ready. Okay. As ready we'll as go. I'll be. <laughs> Way as you'll ever be. <laughs> so we'll go ahead to Wobs. Show them off. Yeah, yeah. Let me, let me, let me see what. I need to and then, and then off. have have lots of questions about two of them. <laughs> <laughs> Don't ban me, Twitch. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> you got me in there. <laughs> oh goodness! You got two of them. Some bars, Mr. Yeah. Popular. And then yeah, at the end, I just added a green screen <laughs> from a short that I did. We'll show that later. Uh. You know, a funny story about that one. Actually, um, you know how YouTube generates a random thumbnail in the video <laughs> that that that's that's the one it shows i'm like no 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 <laughs> well, that's perfect like, no, 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 thumbnail no. material i was like no no <laughs> no, right. no 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 so it, it knows uh, I, it knows, the algorithm knows <laughs> oh no did you know it's now, I have to ask why you went with this one. I know when this was. This is when you scared me with that weird voodoo-looking avatar. So I, I know that. But, like, what, why did you choose me T-posing? <laughs> um, I would, have, I would okay. imagine you'd have better ones than that, I would think. But uh, For, the, for the, the meme value and the... The meme and the I can't remember if I was recording by that time. I don't think I was, which is a shame then. <laughs> yeah, because I was just getting my VR stuff on, so I very doubt I was recording at that moment. Ah, the thing's cursed. The From voodoo doll! It looks like you're, it's look like you're T-posing to someone through this door, and like they're looking at you, and you're just T-posing. Okay, it's a uh, bail. T pose and it won't attack. The universal, the universal way to protect yourself from bear attacks, everyone. Number T pose and you will be safe. You know you can By just way, add two bright eyes voice. right here. <laughs> Ooh, editing ideas. Yeah, just yeah. like dot dot red and that's it. Actually, you could use this thing's <laughs> eyes. Dot red you can use the. <laughs> You could have used the, that previous avatar's <laughs> eyes. Dude, just, yeah, take, <laughs> just take them out and put them in there with a little transparency. for safety. <laughs> <laughs> I'm nothing but an inanimate object. Yeah. Just ignore yeah, I me. Just, I just... I know, I, I, wanted to, I wanted to put one of the pictures where I joined immediately and there was re- your reaction. You, you were partly confused that I 
was there or wasn't well, there. Well, see, I, I looked just... over my shoulder. I believe if I remember correctly, I looked to see if anyone joined. I saw you on my list. I looked around and I, like, for a fraction of a second, I saw, like, your head peek around <laughs> the corner and it actually freaking freaked me out for a second. <laughs> Anyone got anything there? All right, no one for Chapman's building. <laughs> e. You had to do that, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> hmm. So, what's the title for this? <laughs> um... I know, I know. Uh, what's that line that Beavis and Butthead say all the time? <laughs> <laughs> that would be perfect. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know, but what would you, what would you recommend the title? On the surface of that world, this is that world where that tree came from, by the way, for context. This is the above surface of it. And I believe this was like the only body anywhere on the map, if I remember correctly, just dying here in the desert. Yes, I think so. Yeah. Some poor I tried a few man. of my self laying at different positions on the ground. But then I forgot I have holes in my boots, so I'm like, ah, dang it. I got holes in my boots. <sighs> Dang it. So I didn't end up picking any of those. I mean, other than uh, the uh, <clears throat> uh, sewing uh, angle on the uh, gentleman there, I, I like the arches and everything. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, I was, I was going for I was going for center shots, you know. Yeah. yeah uh, the... I did try and take center shots, you know, of the the thing in the background. The sort of the almost like the uh, nether portal looking uh, things <laughs> that were further ahead. Nether I portal. On because oh, no. purely for this. Yeah, the arch, the, the archways, portal. they really just Whoa. frame, you know, the 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 subject matter of this shot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. They exactly. only highlight the exactly nether what? portal. <laughs> <laughs> That's for sure. <laughs> Nether regions. Um. Yeah. <laughs> oh, dear. I almost want to take this photo and, like, use my, like, my face emote where I'm, like, fearful Horrified. and nervous. Uh, yeah. yeah. Where I'm, like, nervous and just, like, green screen it, like, behind one of these pillars peeking out. Just, just for laughs. <laughs> oh, like, man. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, I definitely like the the lighting and the pillows and that. Maybe, maybe uh -huh. if the camera was just, uh, I don't know, maybe a little uh -huh. bit more up, <laughs> maybe yeah, yeah, could, it would. I could. I could, I could, I could see that. Yeah. A little bit closer. You'd have a little bit more of the back and the head versus just um, the nether portal. <laughs> Any, anyone else got anything? Uh, no, no. We're all, we're, we're all speechless. That's good. That's what I mean. Speechless? <laughs> then on, what do we get for? This one I really like. I like the, the lighting generating from the tunnel and you got Marcus there running innocently into the, the, the harbor bay there and it has really nice lighting going down the land on and that. And you got darkness contrasting the lights and that. I, I really like the really the whole frame of that. I, I really don't have anything bad to say about it. I mean and Marcus ain't like floating or doing other weird VR shenanigans that sometimes happens when you're doing photos. We've all had those photos, right? 
somebody's leg jensing yeah. into the sky or something like. <laughs> I did, have, I did have two other. I did have two other pictures, I believe. Um, I think you, you cause I think you were in the other two. But you were jumping in the air, and I was like, it looks uh, kind of. Yeah. And the other one, I don't remember. Because yeah. Without like a proper like pose or expression or some, you know, if it's just like this, it it doesn't look yeah. natural. <laughs> mm -hmm. so the video audience, okay. you know, you want you want to actually have like some kind of pose or something you know when you're just doing this you know it doesn't doesn't look <laughs> doesn't look normal <laughs> but i like it i don't i don't have anything bad to say at all you have the subject now nice contrast angles <laughs> i think this is probably my favorite out of yours <laughs> Yeah, I like it. Mm -hmm. The crowd's speechless. Wob gets a perfect. He wins the crowd. Cheers uh. and praises. <laughs> and he wins the new car, too. Well, lucky, a car? lucky. Yeah, you get a car under Chapman's name. Oh, man. I can't even drive, but that's that's cool. <laughs> I'd say lucky dog, but you know you're kind of a horse, so. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we'll move on then. Nobody else has anything. Then I guess you can answer Jess's question on this one. <laughs> What's your question? What's your... I don't. I don't know. What's on your mind? Was it? <laughs> Wasn't it, wasn't it, why, why me or something like that? <laughs> why me? Why'd you take a picture of me? Didn't even get my good you know, side. You know what this <laughs> reminds me of? Like, if you flip this around, you, you ever see that meme with the little goal in the corner with a house burning in the background? Like, this kind of oh, reminds yeah. me of that. <laughs> yeah, where was this at? Like... <laughs> this should have been the end of that Devil May Cry. I think that's the fiery boss that was near the end. Yeah, where it I was think. behind. This was the doorway to the stairs that I took a picture. Just like one in the in the moment. Oh, when I was trying to get you, get you through breaking, the doorway, breaking through. <laughs> yeah, yeah. We gotta escape. Look at that level of concentration. <laughs> as well as I had a picture of Atticus, um, where obviously... Borning, borning everything. You know, I kind of feel like if there, if you found something humorous to put in the reflection of the eyes, with just a little detail or something, and that, uh. I'm not sure what to put there, but like if you put mm. something that would add to the humor of just destruction in the background, like, I, I don't know, it just would have been like something extra funny. You know, I, I just like thinking about stuff like that sometimes. You gotta get creative when you make thumbnails sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, I like it. It really, it really gives me that vibe of that meme with the little girl with the house burning in the background. Flip it over Will. it's on the s same side with her. The only thing is, like, if you had a better, like, um, how should I say, like a... Like a uh, uh, me, uh, um, 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 what, what kind of face expression I'm trying to think of, uh, of uh, like, well, you're like a devious, Shocked. more like kind of devious yeah. looking expression. <laughs> Something gives you like your troublemaker or trickster, or little goblin, <laughs> you know, like, other than that, like right. that, that would just made it perfect. If it, other than that, yeah, it, it just gives me vibes of that meme, <laughs> but I like it, you know, you got Bored background of chaos. Who knows what's going on? Are these bodies standing up from the fire going, Ah! Is a house burning down? Who knows? Only the, <laughs> the true mastermind does. <laughs> Anything else, anyone? Oh. You still wait? Okay. <laughs> 
You've just been quiet. Just one one. <laughs> okay. Then. And I believe the next one's the last one, I think. Yes, yes, yes. Come. This is Jess again. Yeah. Nice morning stretch before jog, right? <laughs> You're yeah, just like, ah, oh, this this morning I'm going to Lakes <laughs> walk out, finally. Yeah, it was, it was when it was when you uh yeah, you Atticus and Jesse were talking in the the, the main little lobby. I was snapping pictures of you both. All of a sudden I see Jesse stretching all you and I just was like, Yeah, picture. <laughs> and just, you know, I just, I just it. It works. He's within the, the uh, where is it, the Wall of Thords? Uh, yeah. That's the white terminology for white, the Wall of Thords, with the grid. Yes. That's the white thing, right? Uh, like yeah. so I'm horrible at technical terms. I'm terrible. Don't rely on me as a teacher. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, falls in that. There's a nice background in that. Lights or... Almost in a pretty decent alignment to themselves that yeah, The I little contrast over here with a little darkness Yeah, I wasn't trying to go for like a centered sort of uh, Cause I hadn't set up the camera where it was fixed uh, um, I had taken centered shots And I thought they were okay, but because there was nothing really going on as I said that previous pictures, I thought I could so like yeah man. So I didn't I didn't submit most of the centered shots I took of that world. Hmm. Yeah. It's pretty simple, but uh, lovely. And you know, you got light or darkness contrast. Like I said, you know, the lights themselves are almost in a nice position themselves. I mean. Very simple if, pose. If you and... were if you were just taking a picture of the architecture and the environment, then yeah, I would I would say like you'd probably have to straighten up the image or whatever and, and get it symmetrical. But since I'm I'm in the image and I'm stretching, it's like more relaxed feeling. Yeah. I would say uh, yeah. nice chill vibe, chill points. Yeah. And okay. make sure that was anyone else got anything? Nope. What the? <laughs> That's a really weird echo effect, though. <laughs> and then that—that that should have been the last, <laughs> I believe. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Yep, and yeah, that—that's from a. Uh, a YouTube show I made with that whole snuffy meme thing. I just thought I'd just throw it at the end for laughs. <laughs> I was like, eh, I got extra. I fill in the rest of the music with it. <laughs> yeah, if you know that snuffy meme. <laughs> I I do not. You're gonna have to you're gonna have to send me it or post it in the Discord or, oh, or like, something. When when that snuffy like commissioned someone to like do a song, and like. Everyone like made all kinds of animations and crap of it. So, you know, I have that snuffy avatar So I just figured eh, why not? I was experimenting with YouTube shorts. So I, I was okay. like, yeah, why not? Just it's not super creative, but I was like, yeah You don't see a lot of snuffy avatars. So there you go. And That is everyone submitted photos. I did want to do something actually funny or as an introductory thing but uh, I fell behind and I actually had this from something else so I was like ah I'll just throw this in because you know I can always change it you know and like I said uh, anyone else who would anyone else who wants to do like a green screen intro thing um, you mm -hmm. know if you do one and you ever want to change it you know you you could change it it's not really hard just uh, want to try and keep them in uh, like the length of time that the Name plates are up there, so they're not going to be like super long in that. But uh, no. how, how is that? What two or three seconds? Five, five seconds? Uh, 
uh, the exact time with you. I can and, just uh, try and do something. That, actually, before I answer that, actually, uh, what did you all feel about the length of the pictures and the names on this one? Because, uh, like I said, the fourth session mm -hmm. I did, uh, I was running short on time and was kind of just quickly getting it all put together. I didn't get to really experiment the uh, lengths too much in the viewership, so I uh, I said I was going to improve that with this one, and I did make them all a little longer. Does everyone feel like that was better with this? Or do you feel oh, like yeah, for sure. you still think... Yeah, okay. it, yeah it, was, it was a lot better, but when you first played the video uh, just in its total, I thought it was going by a little bit quick, but because obviously when we're up on the stage, it feels longer, so it feels like it's probably the, the perfect amount of time. Yeah, that's good, yeah. that's good. Yeah, I, I did a few viewings of this one, and I was kind of like, okay, I feel like this one has a better pace to it. The, the other one, yeah, definitely felt. And uh, I can show you the first one if you want, Omega. Uh, but uh, let's see. So, look at the Three, length I have there. Four, five, at least five, six seconds. Okay. So, like, six, seven seconds of that, you know, if you want to do a funny green screen it's intro good. thing with your name and you can pick it back well if you you can either green screen and put whatever you want in it or you know i guess you could just have your own background of whatever world you're in you know whatever you want to do that. <laughs> green screen something in or that you know that's a fun side thing i thought of doing uh after like our last session of that so but e. mm -hmm. And of course, you know, if you ever make one, you want to change it up, you know, it's not hard, you know, you just give me what you want and I just slap it in, in the same spot, so not, not very complicated there. Uh, here, look at the other one, I'll show Omega that one real quick, Good so okay. you can see what I mean about how it was, I was running short on time and it was just... Uh, I didn't get to properly do the shirt walk. If not, I'll have to open up and get this shield thing. <laughs> oh wait, no, that's no, that's the that's the actual the ah, that's the wrong one. What is that? <laughs> that's the actual fatigue that? night of that session, not the not the uh, watch, the, the um... Let's watch it in its entirety now. <laughs> Well, it's yeah. a critique, kind of oh, long. critique night. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Well, crit yeah, that's, critique that's a little, the critique that's night. That's a little long. <laughs> so I, I really, I really line. like what you Walking said in this though, spot <laughs> here. It's like. Totally agree. Totally agree. I totally agree with Atticus in the video. Let me go find this. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> What's I coming out of the back of my head? Chapman. I did show Chapman the uh, well, session, that's your little by the way, the hair one, <laughs> I don't like it. I don't, I don't really like how Rob's clipping through the beanbag chair in this shot here. See. <laughs> yeah, I don't like it either. I think he's being a nobad. <laughs> Oh no! Oh, woo. Typical Rob behavior. Wow. <laughs> I'm trying to remember which channel. Ah, there it is. <laughs> oh, I remember what he was telling me about how I'd already seen the part of the, the video. <laughs> No. Okay, now I got it. Now I should have the white link for it, so. But yeah, I didn't get the properly time, so the, it kind of goes by a little fast. It's like, oh, yeah. Kind of forgot to kind of stretch out the time some of that. <laughs> uh, the last session we did a challenge system, so like... It'll introduce the challenge, and then we each chose a photo for that challenge. 
but yeah, it goes kind of by a little too fast. So hopefully, uh, the second mm -hmm. editing seemed fail. Ooh, I like this one. Ooh, you got a candid point. <laughs> I'll have to see what the score was on that one. <laughs> yeah, did he just turn the tide? <laughs> <laughs> now, I am going to stop it on... So, I mentioned uh, uh, his previous one had that meal quack thing. So, see, uh, he had mm -hmm. that vibe going on with this one, is what I was referencing in that regards. <laughs> Gasp. <laughs> I still need to go there. Like, that literally looks like a photo oh, on a wall. Well. <laughs> and I just filled the dead air with, with my gift of my candle. So, yeah, that was the, the first video session we did since Chapman has been busy, busy, busy. So, um, yeah, I didn't get uh, a good timing on all the stuff. So hopefully everyone found the second session uh, bell length on everything, hopefully. Yeah, yeah, for sure. So, yeah, I will use those times for future ones then. All right, and uh, hopefully you had fun at the Critique Night Omega. Thank you for joining, though. No? Hopefully you had fun of that. I know you only got to join for a little time on the one critique night with me and Wob for a little bit, just for a short bit. But uh, if you wish to submit videos for the next critique night, uh, you know, uh, you don't have to choose photos from the uh, events when we hop worlds. You're welcome to choose photos from anything you know they could be from the vr dance or game nights or things like that or hangouts and stuff so uh even if you have trouble coming to any of the world hopping events you're you're welcome to submit photos from other stuff of that if that didn't uh, like... seem clear mm -hmm. yes well i got a question yes well yeah. uh... I know it's a VR photography club, but how do the opinions on, say, IRL photos and stuff? That, that's a funny thing you bring up. So Antag, um, Antag has recently been in VR chat again. And okay. um, I don't, I don't think, I think I talked about that a little bit with uh, Jess, I believe. Um, because I don't think Jess met Antag before. I think he had stopped coming to the photo club when Jess joined to find them correctly but uh, i told Ante, possible, you know yeah. he was welcome to join that and um when we did the last session after i talked to him uh he said he had a anime convention thing he was going to some con or that so i told him Ooh. hey you know uh if you want you can uh share those and uh we could do a real world critique night on them <laughs> Oh. He's like, oh, that might be interesting, that. So uh, that that could be uh, uh, something might uh, actually do. Um, if there's a particular thing, like you have actual wheel photos, if people interested in critiquing wheel photos, uh, we could do that too. You know, we can, we can have a session or maybe like slip in a wheel photo with your VR chat photos of that. Uh, if that's something people seem interested in, uh, we can do that to certain different degrees. We could have a certain critique night on it, or just uh, slip one or two in with other photos too. That you know, we can talk about that I'm on Discord for, though. I'm up for either or. Yeah. Try to do a photo on that. See if people are okay with it. That I don't. I wouldn't see why people would have a problem with it, but I don't know. Maybe maybe real life might be too much for some people. <laughs> <laughs> that, that is true. <laughs> Could be. 
<laughs> well, the real world is a scary and sad place at times, depending on where you are. <laughs> yeah. It's, it's, yeah. Yeah. You got any, any uh, questions or anything, Omega, about the whole thing? Since it was your first critique night that? Mm. I know, like I said, uh, you didn't get to really uh, join very long with the uh, photo session. I believe you said someone uh, needed you or something when you left, I believe. I think you said somebody was, like, uh, sad or something, I think. Wait, who said? I don't remember. Like, I, I think you said someone needed you when you left, when you joined the one uh, critique night or something. I can't remember. Ooh, yeah. Could be. Been, the... Like, going around a lot. Ugh. But, yeah. So, I, I know you're still, uh... <laughs> Uh, experiencing how this all is and that, you know, and you're always welcome to ask any questions that, but uh, thank you for joining Omega, it was nice having you here and that for the critique night hopefully you enjoyed <laughs> and hopefully next time you can send some photos <laughs> <laughs> hey then uh, if no one else has anything else to add, I think uh, we will uh, call that the session, I think. Uh. Okay, then I... It's... Oh, mm -hmm. I was just, just going to say, uh, you know, the th thanks. Uh, I enjoyed seeing everybody's photos. Thank you for hosting the Critique Night and making the video as usual. Yeah, yeah. And, yeah, some other videos should be going uh, live on my... Uh, YouTube channel that I'll try to enable to post them in the Discord for uh, those who uh, want the uh, and uh, um, I think I can't remember if it was Jess or Wob who asked about like uh, preserving them before you know uh, if like you want to like copy it or whip it off YouTube or that like I don't have any problem with that or anything uh, if anyone wants to okay. uh, either get a copy or even upload it themselves somewhere or that uh, there's nothing wrong with that in my uh, opinion so you know uh, but I am trying to preserve these and post them on YouTube and that so um, they'll be there for uh, on my channel but if you want them in other places too you know you're welcome to as well but uh, yeah anyway then uh, we it. will yeah. adjourn we will count that as adjourning then so hopefully so when, um... have fun then. okay when are we okay. gonna do the uh, the challenge thing you were talking about, where we had to pick out a world? The world. Well, um, I was going to likely do your world uh, today if people didn't show up, if it was just gonna be you and me. Uh, but since people showed up, I went with the critique night for today. So uh, the next session, we will uh, start doing uh, the world challenge thing. So uh, we're gonna do. Uh, that is a good thing to bring up since uh, we're all here verbally. Um, so we're going to do another kind of challenge thing. And this time it's going to be kind of like the neon light thing. Well, each person's going to choose a wall <laughs> and we're going to take photos in that wall and then ultimately choose one or two photos and then kind of critique and then vote on which we feel was the best for that particular wall category. Which is why I requested everyone to choose a wall. So I got one from Jess. I don't think I got one from Wob yet. He gave me yeah. his photos, but I don't think he sent me. Um, yeah, I'll, I, will, was... I will have to. I will have to. Yeah, I'll have there to have a little look. One. I've got some worlds, but I will have to. Yeah, you didn't I, send I me a send, world submission. I have, to you a, so. I have to send you a VR chat link or something. I don't even know. Hello. Um. Well, if you send me, Hello. like, the world link, Hello, we're just ending the photo club. I'm scared hey. to see the world yeah, raw pics. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah. Wait, but, why? Sorry, it'd be, <laughs> it frightens me. It'd be me. nice for everyone to pick one wall. <laughs> and, and that's why I kept that like, one wall, because I figured between, like, three or four of us, uh, you know, that, that'd be enough little cowboys, uh, if not, if we don't get even more of that. But... Um, that's why I just kept that one world. So, 
then it, you know it shouldn't be too hard for everyone to at least choose one wall. You know, it could be your favorite wall, the wall that you want to see something interesting in, or just just challenge people. Maybe find a feet wall and get William to actually join a session. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> As you know, that, that's the whole joke with William. Just like, oh, aren't you into this, William? It's like, no! <laughs> no, don't, don't do that to William. It's hard enough getting him to come to sessions. Because he, he's having uh, walk trouble on the weekends of that, so... <laughs> but, uh, but yeah, you know, if you want to find something challenging or whether you want mm. to just show off a world or see what people can do with it, you know... No. No. Sorry, I was uh, looking at my world, and there's one that's not available anymore. I don't know what that means. I don't know which world it is. I yeah. yes, I wish I would tell you what the world was before, so yeah. you can make the decision whether you want to keep it there and hope it comes back or not. I really yeah, wish I, would I got say that. I, I got that. like five of those. I'm scared to delete them in case they come back one day. Exactly, because you don't know. I, yeah, I don't, remember, yeah, I I don't remember. I don't remember what it so was. Then just like yeah. I'm just like, well, I just gotta get rid of them, I guess. I got, I got too many. I need space, and eh, it's a shame, but it happens sadly. Oh. But yee yee. <sighs> but yeah, if you all choose the world map, we will start that next. Um, if you need some more time, uh, we got one world, so we can do just and then maybe some random world hopping of that. Uh, but uh, you know, the more we have, uh, the more we can just kind of add them into the rotation. And, uh, yeah, if we get them all pretty soon, we could probably just do an El Cotique night in two or three weeks if we can get a few worlds real quick. Of that. We can just so, we can fill up the World Links channel. I mean, if you want. <laughs> yeah, <that's good>. yeah. <laughs> you can post them, though, if you want. If, if you don't mind people maybe taking a quick peek to get heads up against y'all, you give you competition, you know, Time to look. <laughs> no, it's all good. Just, just, just putting that out there, you know. <laughs> Heck, pin on what it is. Hell, I've, I've already shot thousands of worlds in, <laughs> in just, VR chat. Just, so, just saying, like, you know. I think the last two just times we went out, there, your competition will know. <laughs> yeah, like the last two times we went out shooting as a club, like half of the worlds I've already taking pictures in so i just kind of minger around see if i can get some candid shots or uh. something <laughs> see that's that's a good opportunity find a world you've never been to you want a biomental Sorry. world you always have that you so yeah you know focus on looking for poses and stuff on the people you know that's good idea indeed, indeed. okay then well i'd say uh yeah you know it's all cool and everything, so go about your busy day mm -hmm. lives. Yeah, and for anyone who does uh, VR, VR dance related stuff, uh, I do know Coil Rainbow uh, in about like 12 minutes is going to be working on like a break video. So if you're interested in that, um, she's supposed to be on in like 11 minutes now. Because at least that's time. Uh... Oh, wait, wait, wait. No, wait. No, 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 no. I'm wrong, actually, because she said in. Wait, wait. Let me double check the time. She said an hour after the North American dance. So, was that. Did that start in. Well, let's see. What is the time thing? Bop, 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 bop. Okay, never mind, never mind. Okay, the North American session is starting in 11 minutes. So, okay. So, they're, they're still probably like an hour and a half before that. But still, you know, if you're interested in that, you might want to keep an eye on Claire <laughs> Wayne, though, if you. Happen to know her or half the people in VR dance. I know Wob knows a few probably through uh, Wing Ding. I don't. I don't think you really know anyone in VR dance, do you, Jess? I don't, no, I don't. Think I don't. You know really Other than yeah, I don't know. Is Chi and Chapman in it? I see them dancing yeah, on Twitch Chapman, all the time. I mean, Chapman's part of it. Chapman's part of the people who makes it, so uh, yeah, that's mm. more of an understatement for him. Um, I know Chi, Chi uses the VR dance world for live streams. Um, yeah, I, I, I watch I their really streams every seeing, now and then, but that's about it. I mean, I don't, I don't really recall seeing Chi join any of the actual VR dance groups sessions, though. 
but mm. I know they use the wolves for their live stream, so... Mm. You got a question, Wob? Yeah, there was a time, I, I think it was for like the the Marshall Thon thing, I believe, because I, I remember seeing Chi and a few other people. That I've only ever, yeah, like only a, ever seen Chi. That was like a four-day dance the thon Man, that was crazy. Yeah, okay, so I don't, yeah, so. I may have only seen Chi like once. Oh, it's going to be anything. even longer though. Isn't there like 50 new yeah. videos on top of it? <laughs> oh, it's going to be all the Marshalls. Oh, <laughs> I don't know how people... Cool, you need to be careful and not kill themselves doing it. Anyway then, uh, but yeah, I just figured I'd throw that out there for anyone who's interested in that. Um, I'm going to try and attend it, so you can always uh, watch for, like, check on where I am in probably like an hour and a half or something. If you want to join Claire Rainbow's little uh, break video thing or that. But anyway, uh, yep, we'll uh, pretty much done that. Thank you everyone for joining. Uh, thank you for the photo submissions there. Uh, We'll mm -hmm. uh, try to start up with the challenge thing. So yeah, if Wav and Mega, if you want to pick a wall to add with the, the challenge thing, we can throw that in. And, uh, you know, if you can't make the the days of the event, like, you know, you can always go to the wall. Like, we'll po like, we'll probably do, like, Jess's Forced the next session. So, like, if you can't make it and the session's over, I'll post what the world was. So those who want to still do it can do it on their own time and go get photos in that world of that. So, you know, we'll, we'll play open about, so. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, courts are drawn. No one's going to jail yet. Make sure you send the bill to Chapman, though. Okay. Okie okay, dokie, dude. Thank you.